Hi. Hi. Um, so in the movie, you play Roy McBride, an astronaut venturing out to the edges of the solar system. What role do you think movies such as Ad Astra play in inspiring the new generation of explorers, the Artemis generation, who in their lifetime mm. could see people living on the moon, on Mars, and beyond? You know, I think it all contributes to, um, I don't know, there's a, really pu a real push right now, you know, if there's a real excitement for the possibilities, what we could learn about um, beyond, what we can learn about ourselves. And um, I think this just, I, I, I think films like this just contribute to that. Yeah. So you did, you got to speak to astronaut Nick Cage today. I did, I sure did. Between the movie and this conversation, was there anything that you learned about space that um, that you didn't think you, that was exciting? No, I was just, I mean, I, uh, several things, but I was just, I was really moved to talk, he talked about his daughter and what it would mean for her and future, you know, astronauts. He, he, talk, he talked about that he probably will not be able to set foot on Mars, but the younger generation who are seeing this now and seeing the work and, and the direction they're paving will we'll make that way for What for does space younger. exploration mean to you? Well, it's exactly that. I think, you know, we, 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 have, to, we have to venture further to, again, to, it's so mysterious. I mean, forces that will rush matter and bend time. I mean, it's, it's infinite. I mean, it's beyond our understanding. So for that, and, and again, what we can learn about ourselves, but at the same time, I think, you know, all the astronauts that I had heard seemed to talk about it makes them appreciate Earth all the more and our responsibilities as custodians of Earth and, and with each other. And I, I found that really powerful. So in the movie, um, you and your father uh, end up spending a lot of time in space. And so that can be really difficult on the mind and mm. just a human's mm. body in general. Mm. Um, what Do you have a newfound... I guess, appreciation of that in the sense of having to portray and play that character in the movie. And it was very emotional. Well, I've, you um, know, I find, I find life on Earth, you know, the toughest thing about it is the battle of the mind, isn't it? And so out, out, you know, out there we're really, I think we're using it as a metaphor to portray the loneliness that we can all feel at one time or another, that utter loneliness. And... And it will take us. It will take a unique individual that could endure that kind of um, isolation. All right. Well, thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. Thank it's you. a pleasure speaking All with right. you. Thanks. Good to see you. We have.